Hey guys, this is my March favorites video. This is, if you're new to YouTube or the beauty community at YouTube, which you're probably not if you're watching this, but you might be, it is where uh, people who do beauty videos or makeup videos or hauls or whatever, one time a month at the beginning of the month, we'll pretend this is the middle of the month, we'll forget, we'll pretend like it's the first, you uh, do a favorite video of the previous month. So at the beginning of May, I'll do an April favorites video, and at the beginning of June, I'll do the May favorites video. So it's just basically the products you've used throughout that month. It can be new things, it can be old things, it doesn't have to be beauty stuff, and that all mine's not going to be beauty products, because I want to switch it up, because there's other things that I think this is a good time to introduce, maybe other things that you like or enjoy that just aren't beauty centered because otherwise you don't really have an opportunity to share those with anyone. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. I just have a few products, not a whole lot, but the first one I'm going to tell you about is these uh, Pons Deep Cleansing um, Makeup Remover Pads or Towelettes. They work so well to get makeup off and I don't use them for my whole face. I just use them for my eye makeup. There's 30 towelettes so if you use one a day it'll last you a whole month and I just use one I'll use one side for one eye and then I'll turn it over to the clean side and use use it for the other eye and what's great too is they sell the thinner packets and I think they have about 15 in them but you could get a couple of those put one in your car put one in your gym bag you know so when you, you've been sweating you've been working out you can kind of towel off and clean your face or your neck or whatever uh, if you're in the car and it's in the summer and you're hot or if you want to change your eye makeup from day look to night look and you're not at home you know lots of next Thing is the Oscar Blondie Pronto dry shampoo this is a small bottle this is 12 I think dollars at Sephora they also have a larger bottle um, and they also have a aerosol can but I don't recommend the aerosol can I got that by mistake one time I actually had someone go for me and they got the wrong thing and they got the spray it doesn't work as well the way it comes out is almost like a hairspray. Your hair feels more sticky than it does fresh. So I really like this one. This little bottle lasts me several months because I don't use it every day. And usually when I do use it, I'll just use it on my, like where I'm parting my hair and on the sides and down in the back just right here. And then I'll kind of massage it in and then brush it through. Where it works so well, it doesn't leave you with white hair. It's kind of lemony fragrance, which is very fresh, I think. I love it. And you don't, it takes, a little goes a long way with this product. The next thing is, I love this fragrance. It is the Philosophy Falling in Love. It's $15 at Sephora. It smells delicious. It smells like f fruity... Vanilla E. It's described, I think, as blackberries and vanilla as far as the scent. Very summery. It's lovely. It's such a sweet fragrance. Okay, then this I'm going to do as a duo because I wear them as a duo. Very springy, very marchy. And it is two MAC eyeshadows. Okay, the first one is Sumptuous Olive. It's a beautiful olive color. It's described as kind of a khaki olive. So it kind of has some brown undertones to it, and it is a Velux pearl, so it, it does have a bit of uh, shimmer to it. I have blue eyes, and it, it goes really, I think it works really well with blue eyes. I like it a lot. And then I, I usually, most always, pair it with corduroy, and this is a matte. And I'll use this in the crease. You can probably tell. I love this color. This needs a review of its own, its own little video. But I use this all the time for just everything. I use it by itself. I use it with eyeshadows together. Every color. It just it's a it's a very um, versatile eyeshadow. The next thing is a blush uh, used a lot by myself, uh, as you can tell. I've hit the pan, not tin pan, but can't do Project Tim Pan. I don't have that much stuff. But uh, this is NARS Angelica. And I think for spring, it is such a perfect color. It's a beautiful baby pink. And I wish you could see the flecks in it of shimmer. Maybe you can right there a little bit. 
the shimmer in it is very fine, but it, it does show up a little bit on your cheeks. But I use this color almost every day, especially in the springtime. It looks really natural and kind of almost like a cotton candy pink. Okay, the next two things are non-beauty products. So if you don't want to watch these, then you can just go ahead and say bye to me now. But I think these are so cute. I see them on little kids all the time, and they are silly bands. Have you ever heard of these? I, I, I've heard that they're not very popular in some parts of, like, the country or in the United States. I don't know if overseas if y'all have these. If you're watching, let me know. I'm curious. But this is from the spring one. It's got a kite. It's got a chicken. I should do the umbrella. It's got a tulip, a bee, a couple other things. But they're rubber bands, but people wear them on their wrists. So, I don't know. It's just, you know, I'm 25. I don't need these. But they're so cute. I just think they're adorable. And I babysit a lot. So, you know, it's cute. The kids can be like, oh, you have some. So, there's two brands. There's the actual Silly Bands brand. And they're, f I think it's $5 for a pack of 25 And then there's another brand called Shape. Brand, uh, bands or something. I don't know. And I got a pack of those somebody got me for Easter. And they're a little bigger. These are small and more, I guess, tightly uh, made. So the other ones, if you have bigger hands and you want to get some, you should probably get the other kind. I don't know the name of them though. They sell them at Walgreens. I know that. These usually places like I got those at Hallmark there's places uh, kiosks in the mall that sell them and that's the only place I know of CVS might sell them okay so then the next thing is kind of a big item but I've really been using it a lot the past month and it is the Mophie if you have an iPhone this is something that every person who looks at their phone and they're like <gasps> 20% left. Oh no. And then you have like a three hour night class or you're at work for four more hours and you're like texting people and all of a sudden your phone goes, just whatever you're doing stops and then you see the little thing go and then your phone dies. That's me all the time. I charge my phone every night and then I've gotten to this bad habit the past couple of months where I just like, I'm like too lazy to plug it in. So this works. Because it's got an outlet plug in here, and it comes with the cord. Actually, I have it right here. comes with this into your computer, into the Mophie. Charges. There's a button on the back that lights up. There's this black button. You press it, and that tells you how much of a charge you have. You have three dots, and there's four. So you've got a pretty good charge on it. And you just stick your iPhone into this, and you can still use your phone and it charges it at the same time. So I'll put this on my phone, on my computer at night, charge it, charge my iPhone, and then I'll go ahead and put this in my te like technology coach wristlet that's in my purse. And if I need it, then I can take it out and I don't have to worry about my phone dying. So if you have an iPhone, I would get one of these. They have a new kind. I think it's called the Mophie Air, and they're plastic, and this is kind of a rubberized material. It's hard, but it kind of has that rubbery feel, but then the new ones are in colors. They have purple, they have white, they have black, they might have red. I know they have those three colors, but my dad has one of those, and he says that he actually thinks the original works better. I don't know. This is a little thicker. It's kind of chunky and bulky, but hey, you know, if you don't have a phone and then you have this option, I'd rather have the bulky charger. So that's my March favorites video. I'm sorry that it's late. I will be better next month, but have a good day. Bye. This is such a teeny tiny bottle. It looks like a little baby. <laughs> Uh, I don't even want to put this in here. It just, it really looks really, um, really, 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 or blondie, blondie, I don't know.